We know the John Lewis advert cost a million pounds to create a 90 second clip. Uh, the, the, the shop then went on to spend five to six million pounds uh, promoting it. Um, but there's an advert which has taken social media by storm. It is uh, for a pub in Northern Ireland. It's left viewers in tears. Uh, here it is. God knows what is hiding in those weak and drunken hearts Guess he kissed the girls and made them cry Those hard-faced creeps of misadventure God knows what is hiding in those weak and sunken lights Fiery thrones of muted angels Giving love but getting nothing back Oh, Where's the Guinness? There's the Guinness. Guinness is coming up. So the old, the old guy takes there he is. the table. He's got his Guinness. Guess he's kind of Guinness. He's sat on his own. And the young couple in their early 20s, I guess, have a drink. He, their little dog comes over to talk to him. So the dog makes the first introduction and says hello to the elderly gentleman. He's sitting on the, the old man's lap, sitting next to him now. And then the younger couple come over My talking is ruining it for the viewers, but I'm conscious of people on the radio that might not know what's happening here. And the young couple... They come over to down. sit down, sit with him and their drinks. Shake his hand and say hello. And they cheers their drinks. Charlie's Bar. There are no strangers here, only friends you haven't met yet. And that's a WB Yates quote. Oh, it's, it's lovely. so lovely, that's isn't it? And it's oh, gone it's so viral. It's it's yeah. huge. It, I mean, it's I just know. the power of social media. Isn't I know. It, um, it goes but, to the heart of Christmas, yeah, exactly. doesn't it? Uh, you old know, people on their own, a nice young couple. The dog breaks the ice. Yeah. And totally rooted in place as well. That's yes. what's different. So all these ads that we see, like the John Lewis ad yeah. and the other Christmas ads, I mean, you know, all shot in, in June in a studio. But that just gave us a real sense of Enniskillen as a place, yeah. didn't yeah. it? So did that's why I really like it. Weepy? It did, actually. I'm feeling, I'm here. I'm feeling a bit tearing up. Oh, I, yeah, definitely yeah. have tears in my eyes. I think this is really, really lovely, obviously for, for Enniskillen and for the sort of localness of it all, but also loneliness is such a big uh, issue oh. for people of all ages. And yeah. I hate to bring up the pandemic, but it was one of the biggest consequences, mm, totally. mental health consequences, was anxiety, depression, eating disorders, and loneliness amongst, the, amongst young people, people of all ages. And the elderly. But the reminder mm. that the elderly... And you can be lonely in a crowd, you can be lonely with, mm. on your own, you can be, you know, it's just the idea, especially at this time of year, that just reach out and, you know, means more than Christmas presents or anything, is that you maybe talk to an elderly neighbour, check they're okay, that yeah. kind of thing. And I think yeah. loneliness is one of the things in our society that people are ashamed of and that people live with and that people don't talk about, especially when they're, when they're older. And I think, I think one of the reasons it is so poignant, you, you mentioned the pandemic, you said we don't want to talk about it, but we have to because during that time, we didn't say hello to healthy people. We didn't take our masks off. We didn't smile. It was the wariness of other people. It was wariness people. of yes. strangers. Yeah. It was wariness of the people that you loved in your own family. We, yeah, were, yeah. we, were, you know, we were brainwashed well, to be fearful of other human beings and bringing people together like that. I love it. Yes, absolutely. I mean, I think that that's, that's, that's completely vital. And, and as you say, I mean, this is, this is the spirit of Christmas, is to it actually is. go out and talk to somebody rather than, you know, buying flash yeah. presents in the shops that the other adverts for um, are, are for. So, so, yeah, go out and chat. But it shouldn't be only at Christmas, it's should it? Free. No, absolutely it's not. Free. It yeah. doesn't cost a it million pounds exactly. advert. It no. doesn't cost anything. No, yeah. It literally it's the gift of your time. Yeah, exactly. That you go up to someone in the street and say, yeah. how are you doing? And or sit next to someone on a park bench. And yeah. what a lovely thing. The little dog goes over to, to wags his tail. 
No, 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 it's, it's very just, cute. It's, it's so it's very cute. Somebody's and we did, it, it became, loneliness became a sort of issue that politicians about two or three years ago got really interested in. We had a, briefly did. had a minister, minister for loneliness, Tracy we, Crouch. Was we the, did, and we had, minis, we had MPs um, standing up and talking about their own battles yeah. with loneliness and depression. But it seems to have fallen off the agenda a yeah. little bit, yeah. doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. I'm not sure that, that the, the minister's These been These things go in fashion enough. Yeah, and it needs, to stay in, it needs to stay in fashion it's permanently because it's a very big issue.